Many people ask me, where did I get my $299 pedal drive? Actually, I paid around $350, including the shipping. That company no longer carrying that drive, and they do have more expensive ones. Then about a week ago, Mike, he watched my video, and he told me that he actually got the same drive from a supplier on Alibaba. The best part is the seller shipped that to him within a week. He's in Midwest. In this video, I'm going to share the information of the seller. But before that, I have a disclaimer here. I'm not associated with Alibaba or any other companies I mentioned in this video. I don't receive any benefit from those companies. And I'm also not endorsing any of the companies. I just want to share the information so you have another options to get the drive directly from Alibaba. There's always risk when you shop online, and I'm not responsible for that. After Mike told me that he got the exact drive I have, then I asked him for more information. Here it shows he paid $160 plus express shipping. Total comes to around $259. To me, it's still a good deal because it took him about seven days to get the drive. There are many sellers on Alibaba. It is very nice of Mike to provide a very detailed contact information and the company he got the pedal drive from. I do have an Alibaba account. I did purchase things through Alibaba also. So I'm going to take a look, see if I can find that company. I haven't used Alibaba for more than a year. And when I log in, I noticed there was a sales lady left me a message and she came from Viking. I did look into this company to get a pedal drive in the past. Finally, I decided to get that directly from a US company just because of the lead time for them to ship me the drive. If they ship that to me by sea, it will be a few months delay. In the past, I have to work with the seller to determine the shipping charge. For this company, they list the shipping charge and they also provide shipping by sea and shipping by air which most likely what they mean is by express. Their salesperson usually very responsive. They really want to get your business. Therefore, you may negotiate with them on pricing also. Not many companies has a MOQ minimum or the quantity of one, but for this particular one, they do. Very often, other companies uh, require MOQ more than one piece. For this particular drive, it is 340 shipped to you in US. If I get that from a US seller, it costs me around $500. Some sellers willing to add your brand name on the drive if you purchase 10 pieces. Wherever you get it from, most likely they are all made in China. The dry I have, they are selling it for $229 or $230 if I want to get that by sea. So it takes maybe two months before I can get it. It costs $340 for thin drive. But if I get something similar in US, it is $600. This company has been on Alibaba for a few years and it does have a pretty good rating. I will be paying more to get a pedal drive from a US seller, but I will get better support, better return and refund policy also. Whenever you buy things online, 
wherever you get from, whether China or in US, you really need to know more about the seller. The refund policy stated here is nowhere close to what you can get from Amazon or eBay. Even though I got the drive from US, the way it's being packed is exactly being shown on this Alibaba seller site. Apparently, they may got the drive from the same supplier in China. And when it arrives, there were holes on the package. Then Mike told me he got the drive directly from this seller. And same, the box has the same kind of holes on the box. So wherever you get it, you get the same treatment, a broken box. Luckily, things are working in both cases. So if you buy different drive from the same supplier, you can see it's being packed slightly better. And if you turn out decided to get it from this particular company, I would suggest you spend maybe $50 more to get this drive or the other thin drive instead, which will be packed a little bit better. The big problem is with the holes. There are accessories inside the box, and there's a chance that those accessories may fall out through the holes. I test my drive on this boat here. It works well. Uh, and the drive is pretty solid. Next, I'm going to share my experience shopping on a Chinese website and getting a fake item. If you like these videos, please give me a thumbs up, support me, or better, subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Two years ago, I went to this site and purchased the table tennis rubber which at the cost about one third of what I can get in US. It seems to be too good to be true. And by the time I got the rubber, it looks exactly the same as the genuine one. The printing outside, the internal brochure, including the rubber and also the logos of the rubber which looks exactly like the genuine one. The only thing I notice is the sheet of plastic that puts on top of the rubber. The one shown here, which is a fake one, is very clear. The genuine one is not that clear, not that transparent. I know this could be fake in day one, but I decided to take a chance. If the price is really that good, I plan on buying some more. I wasted $20 and got two pieces of dead rubber.